Next, we're going to be talking about measurement equations. As you can see, we have 2 yards plus 7 inches plus 5 feet equals how many inches? We want to turn everything into inches since that is what we are looking for. This is already in inches, so we're not going to do anything with that. But 2 yards needs to be turned into inches, so we're going to write underneath it blank inches plus 7 inches, because again, it's already in inches, plus blank inches, because we want our 5 feet also in inches, equals blank inches. Then we need to box the ones that are different, the ones that we need to change. So 2 yards into inches needs to be boxed, and 5 feet into inches also needs to be boxed. These are what we need to solve for. So if you remember, we do one, two, special number, three. And over here, one, two, special number, three. The first step is to see if we need to multiply or divide. So when we are going from bigger to smaller, we multiply. So I will put an X right there. Then we need to find out how many of our smaller goes into our larger. Well, how many inches fit into one yard? The answer would be 36. So that is our special number. Once we figure out our special number, we can take the two numbers that we have, the one that's in our box, and we can multiply it by our special number. So what I will do is for step three, I'll do 36 times two. Two times six equals 12, carry your one. Two times three equals six, plus one equals seven. That 72 will go in our box on our blank. Then I move over to five feet equals how many inches? Again, we need to see if we're gonna multiply or divide. So we need to see if we're going bigger to smaller or smaller to bigger. And in this case, we are also going bigger to smaller. So we will multiply. Then we ask ourselves how many of our smaller fits into our larger. Since there are 12 inches in one foot, that will be our special number. And then we will take our two numbers and we will multiply them. So 12 times five. Five times two equals 10. Carry your one. Five times one is five plus one is six. That equals 60. Once we have done that, we can now add everything up. So we will do 72 plus seven plus 60. And I will write that right here off to the side, just so that we can get it, plus seven, plus 60. And the order doesn't matter, because if you remember when you add, the order of your add-ins does not matter. Two plus seven plus zero is nine, seven plus six is 13. And so our answer will be 139 inches.